Hey guys, David here, and this is the top 10 cutest Pokemon. So, um, so keep in mind, this is just my opinion. So don't, so don't get mad if like your favorite Pokemon is on this list. Um, um, like I, I mean, we could do a part two if you guys want. I would love to do a part two. Without further ado, let's get to number ten. And number 10 we have on the Bulbasaur on the first stage of Ivysaur and Venusaur. Um, credits to three, um, credit to three, to three and Ren to three and Reek of the drawing on the Bulbasaur. Look at it. It's a freaking creature with a C on its back. That is really, really cute in my opinion. Don't you just want a Bulbasaur in your freaking house? Let's go to number 9. At number 9 we have on the Chigorita on the first stage of Bayleaf and Meganium. On oh, no name but credits to you for John Chigorita. Look at it. Uh, I'm just like Bulbasaur, it's a creature, but this time it has a leaf on its head. That is a cute thing that I have ever seen. Look at it! I want one in my house. Let's go to number 8. At number 8 we have Pichu. I'm on the first stage of Pikachu and Raichu. Um, credits to review on the drawing on, on the two Pichus actually. Look at it. It's a cute ass mouse. You cannot tell me that you do not want this electric cute mouse in your house to live with you. Look at it. It is adorable. Let's go to number 7. At number 7 we have Mew who rivals with Mewtwo. Um, no name, but credits to you for drawing Mew. Look at it. It is a cat-like creature that can fly and loves to make bubbles and play and be mischief. I love it so much. Look at it. Even its tail is cute. Let's go to number six. And number six we have uh, um, Celebi. Oh, one of the mythicals in Johto. Um, credits to Canary Charm of John Celebi. Look at it. It's a plant-like creature. It's a living plant. Actually, it's living celery. Look at it. It can fly. It can time travel. Celebi is just so cute. Look at this. I want a Celebi. Let's go to number five. At number five, we have uh, on Charmander on the first stage of Charmeleon, Charizard, the so Mega Charizard X and Mega Charizard Y. Um, no name, but credits to you for drawing uh, um, Charmander. Actually, there's a name down there. I can't read the last name, but credits to you, Michelle, um, for drawing Charmander. Yeah, um, credits to Michelle Simpson for drawing Charmander. I think that's Miss Simpson. I can't read it. I can't. Like, I, I cannot read or write cursive, but. If, if that is your name, then Chris, you, Mitchell Simpson, but don't try it. Look at this. It's a lizard on fire. It's a baby dragon that has not grown its full wings yet. Well, any wings yet. And it's on fire. Look at it. Don't you just love it so much? Yeah, I thought so. Let's go to number four. In number four, we have Poplio on the first stage of Brion and Primarina. Oh. No name, but credits to you for drawing Poplio. Look at it. It's a freaking baby seal that can make bubbles that you can go in if they, if, when they perfect it. Even its eyes and nose are cute. Let's go to number three. In number three, we have Squirtle on the first stage of War Twirl and Blastoise. Um, credits to Midnight Dark Angel uh, on the Pajong Squirtle. Look at it. It's a freaking um, baby turtle that has a cute tail and cute eyes and a cute shell. Just freaking everything about this Pokemon is cute. I mean, look at it. I love it. Let's go to number two. And number two, we have Togepi. Um, credit to Cube Hero on um, for drawing Togepi. 
is also the birth date of Toa Tick and Toa Kiss. Look at it. It's a baby creature inside a, an egg that has just hatched. Look at it. I want a Togepi in my house. Let's go to the six animal mentions that we have. As the first mention, we have Alolan Raichu. Um, now the Alolan form of Raichu in final stage of Alolan Pikachu and Alolan Pichu. Um, from credits to Neon uh, on the Celestia 20 of the drawing Alolan Raichu. Um, as the second mention, we have Marrow. Uh, uh, now the evolved form of Azuril in first stage to Azumarill. Um, credits to Pink uh, on Jeremy for drawing a Marrow. Um, as the third mention, we have Politoed, uh, another final stage of Poliwag, and the first stage of Poliwhirl. Um, credits to, um, credits to Etsy, um, for drawing Politoed. Um, credits to you, uh, uh, Mr. Etsy. Um, as the fourth mention, we have Rockruff, um, the first stage of Lycanroc. Um, credits to Drag, um, credits to Dragon Empress, um, 666, um, for drawing Rockruff. Um, as the fifth mention, we have Combuskin, um, the... First stage of Torchic and first stage to Blaziken and second stage to Mega Blaziken. Um, credits to Pikalu on the Pajon Combuskin. Um, as the last mention we have on the Fusil and Minon. Two, uh, a duo that goes together in Gen 3. Um, credits to, um, credits to Havoc Girl on the John both Minon and Fusil. Let's go to number one. And number one we have. Um, Lidden, on the first stage of Tur of Torica and Incineroar. Um, credits to Saw Do I um drawing um, um drawing Lidden. I'm sorry if I pronounce your name wrong. Just look at Lidden. It's a freaking cat. You've got to love it. Well, I hope you guys enjoy. That's my top thanks to Pokemon. Tell me down in the comments below if you want a part two. And, and tomorrow will be the top 10 Pokemon that would be scary in real life. And I'll see you all next time on Hasta La Vista.